the binding modes of no in 18 electron compounds of these two complexes respectively are and the options are shown here terminal no has that is nitrosyl has two common coordination modes one is uh, linear another one is bent no plus is isoelectronic with the co now we uh, do the electron donor count for these two complexes in the linear method in neutral method no can donate three electrons for bent uh, structure it can donate only one electron but in ionic method NO plus can donate two electrons for linear structure. NO minus can donate two electrons for bent structure. Now we do the electron donor count in neutral method for the above two complexes. For the first complex, we have uh, three carbonates, so it can contribute uh, six electrons. For cobalt, it can contribute 9 electrons. So, totally we have 15 electrons. It is 18 electron compound. So, we subtract 15 from 18, we get 3 electron. So, nitrosyl can donate 3 electron to this complex. Next, we do the electron donor count for the nickel complex. In the neutral method, cyclopentadiene can donate 5 electrons. For nickel, it can donate 10 electrons, totally 15 electrons. It is also 18 electron compound, so we subtract 15 from 18, we get uh, 3. Here also, nitrosyl can donate uh, 3 electrons. So, the two structures are linear structure according to the electron donor count method. The structures can be identified by any mark full thumb notation also. The any mark full thumb notation is used to describe the number of D type electrons present in a complex. It is deliberately ambiguous that is it is not clear because the true oxidation state of metal coordinated by non-innocent ligon is often unclear. And the metal uh, representation that is uh, and the enimark fultham notation is within the flower bracket metal NO power 6. If it is uh, with uh, 6 it is called linear structure. The angle will be 170 to 180. The flower bracket Mn power 8 will have 120 degree angle. So, it is bent structure. If it is 7, that is flower bracket Mn O. That is metal nitrosyl power 7 is uh, having in between this 180 to 120 degree angle. Now we do the electron count in ionic method. For carbonyl, we can donate uh, 6 electrons. So we can represent the first complex as metal N O power 6. For the second complex in ionic method, cyclopentadiene can donate 6 electron. Here cyclopentadiene is innocent ligand. So we can represent this uh, complex as within the flower bracket metal NO power 6. So both the complexes having the first uh, uh, option representation. So, both having a linear structure, both will have a 170 to 180 degree angle.
So the correct uh, binding modes of NO in 18 electron compounds of these two complexes are linear and linear structure. Thank you.